Joe and I were tired of all the fighting, so we decided to sit one out. We saw what looked like a giant meatball fall out of the sky. Turns out it was Edamon, except he was a lot shinier. He was now Metal Edamon, and he was looking for revenge. The other kids were able to get inside of Puppet Mon's mansion, and with the help of some of his unhappy guards, used some of his toys against him. Joe and I found Ogremon, who'd been wounded. When we fixed him up, he couldn't believe we were being so nice to him. Things seemed fairly quiet for a change. Of course, quiet never lasts long here.